What's up guys, welcome back to another video here on Imperial Bricks Productions and today I bring you guys probably the single biggest haul I've had on this channel. Now, as at the time of recording this first package, some of the other packages haven't arrived so due to the magic of editing, I'll just edit that all in and you guys will see it as one big haul video but I uh, just thought I should throw that out there. Now before I get started, uh, I will mention my uh instagram if you guys want to help support me further you can go check that out also i will mention uh the web store uh i will leave a link down uh, below for that as well so if you guys want to go check that out and uh just find some instructions on there that if you like um maybe consider purchasing uh if you do the money from that not only goes to help support myself but also the designers who designed that so uh yeah i guess Without further ado, we can go ahead and get into this. Uh, now, this package is from BrickLink. This is actually my first set uh, ever being purchased from BrickLink. Uh, so I'll see how it goes. Um, another thing, I will try to leave links to everybody, at least on Instagram, that I know that I bought from down below so you guys can go check them out. So, without any further ado, I'm so excited. Let's get into this package. Uh, I did open it up uh, beforehand because I only have one hand to open the package because my camera is still indisposed at the moment so i'm using my phone let's go ahead and open this up now this just give you guys some backstory uh this is a set that i've wanted for years um so let's stand up here and go ahead and start getting this stuff out of the way get this uh it was opened and uh used but everything's still there. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this. Oh, seems like everything's in there. So, as you guys can tell, it is, well, the first set here is the Mont of Moria set from the Lord of the Rings line. Now, uh, a lot of you probably don't know this, but Lord of the Rings and the Hobbit were actually the lines of Lego that got me into uh, Lego and collecting it. And, I actually have almost all of the fellowship, so now with this set, I get Boromir and Pippin, so I'm missing one more member of the fellowship, and hopefully that I will get that set soon that has him, so yeah, uh, it's pretty excited to get this set, it's old, it's tired, got a decent deal on it, I guess, uh, shipping was a bit more than what I thought it was going to be, but uh, yeah, I'm very excited to get this set, so guess without any further ado go ahead and move on to the next package. so guys here's another couple of um packages for uh this haul um both of these are from instagram uh this one is from a guy named uh senior breaks on instagram and this one is from a guy named lego lister so go ahead and dump this or get the contents out of this one let's see yep that's it all right so from oops senior bricks we got three stormtroopers and they all came with weapons so um these are the rogue one versions so still adding to my stormtrooper collection uh, i'm very happy to get these guys so go on to lego listers let's see if i can shake this out maybe not let's see if i'll pick it up let's get this off camera ah, there we go all right so here are a couple of i don't know if you can make this out a couple of wookies i got these for my rebel army still trying to build that as well as my imperial army so kind of make out the one there so one wookie and then the other is the newest version of chewbacca because uh I uh, wanted another one, plus he's a rebel, so still building my rebel army, and uh, yeah, so there's what I got uh, right now, so I guess on to the next uh, part of this haul. So guys, here's another uh, uh, part of this haul, uh, so I guess I'll just go ahead and start digging into it. Uh, this one is from Target, as you guys can see. Um, I actually bought a few things from Target that should be coming in here soon. You guys can see already that it is. Let's get this out of the way. Alright. It 
is Resistance Wyoming. Uh, pretty cool set. Pretty cool minifigures. Uh, I see how this one um, how this one compares to the 2016 um, Rebel Wyoming. And um, yeah, uh, I look forward to building this one uh, uh, here soon. So uh, I guess on to the next next part or next uh, package. So guys, I just got another package in the mail, and this one is from uh, the Brick Wizard 59. Uh, you guys can find him on Instagram and YouTube, of course. Those will be linked below, but, um, you guys probably already know what this, this one, <laughs> this one is. Um, uh, so, dump it out, and, of course, it's more floats for solos because, let's face it, I need more rock work, um, for the bunker area, uh, because it's going to be covered by mountains, mountain, but, um, it should be fine. Um, I'm just going to take it one level at a time, as you guys will probably see here soon, so... Uh, you'll know what I'm talking about then, but I'm just going to take one level at a time and not do it all at once like I did with uh, the second section of Solus, so you guys should be happy to see that. Um, but yeah, I think I got 78 of them from him. I have officially bought all of his that he was selling from his Hogwarts mock, so yeah, happy to have these and happy to be able to um, purchase them from a friend, so uh i guess on to the next package so guys here is uh, another package uh, smaller package uh this is all possible thanks to uh the brick engineer on instagram uh, i'll leave a link to his stuff below and of course you guys probably should or know this by now i buy a lot from him so so just go ahead and open this up now this is an older retired set uh, i got a pretty i guess all right deal for it uh, so let's go ahead and open this up. Oh, it's in the box. Did not see that. All right. Let's see. How am I going to do this one handed? <laughs> All right, let's try this. This may be a little longer because it's a little hard to do single handed. Uh, so let's try this. Come on. Work with me. Uh, let's see if this works. It's a little complicated. Uh, but anyway, this is an older retired set, as I said before. Uh, and I've never really wanted this set before. I just saw that he had it. I was like, yeah, that's cool. I think I'll purchase it. So, ah, there we go. Let's get it. Let's pull this out. It's packaged very, very well. Oh, dang. Oh, boy. All right. So, it is inside of this. All right. All right, this package very well. So uh, let's try this now. Uh, it's oh my goodness! All righty then. Let's try let's turn this off. I need to get a tripod for my phone. Uh, so go ahead and pull this off. Uh, there we go. It's sealed, brand new, in new condition. So here we go. So. Yeah, like I said, it's an older set. Uh, I I knew this uh, battle pack existed, just never really considered buying it before. But kind of glad I did. I uh, got a, I guess, an all right deal on it. But uh, yeah, very happy to have this. And I think it's from like 2012 or something like that. I don't know when, but uh, yeah. So I guess on to the final two packages. All right, guys, so here are the last two packages for this haul. Um, go ahead, I've already cut them open, so I'll just go ahead and dig into the smallest one here and then open the biggest one next. So let's, let's up. oh, and I did forget to mention, they're both from Target, as you can see. Yeah. So this one and the smallest one, it's the Mandalorian Battle Pack. I have wanted this set for ever, actually ever since I so it came out, I've just been um, putting my money elsewhere, so I uh, haven't gotten it. That's why I've gotten it so late, but yeah, uh, whoops, really happy to get this one. I want to build it and see uh, how it looks, but um, I think I want to do a Mandalorian mock here soon, so these guys may uh, uh, come in handy. So, so these guys off to the side, and then the biggest one opened. Let's get this. Oh, wow. This box is bigger than what it needed to be okay so and pick this out 
and it is Luke's X-Wing from like 2018. So I saw it, Target still had it for sale. Um, and this is actually my first X-Wing. So yeah, I, I, was, I won an X-Wing for forever. And uh, I really like the design of Luke's, uh, you know, the red, red's my favorite color. So of course, red five, you know, makes sense. Um, but I also wanted to get the new helmet mold and see how it compares to the older one. Cause I do have a few um, pilots from like the Y wings and things like that that um have the older helmet so i want to see how those compare but yeah pretty excited to get this set um i don't know if it's overpriced or not i think 80 bucks is kind of a steep price for it but you know uh i'll know once i build it but yeah pretty happy to get that so i guess i will uh show you guys everything at once so here it is here is the whole haul and like I said, this was quite the massive haul. So over here, got it. I went ahead and got the X-Wing built. Um, so I really enjoyed this. This was my first X-Wing, by the way, and I really enjoyed the build. Minifigures are fantastic. I, I really do uh, like those, and the helmets are all right. Uh, I do prefer the older style, though, but um, it's cool to have another Luke Skywalker and a couple more astromech droids as well as, uh, I think, Biggs Dark Ladder. So, cool minifigures. Um, haven't gotten time to build this one yet, but I am looking forward to building this one because, you know, it's an older set. I want to I wanna see how it, how it looks. Uh, next, we got the Mandalorian Battle Pack, and I really like that. Um, the minifigures are spectacular. The builds, uh, it's a Battle Pack build, so, I mean, not much can be said about it, but... Many figures are, of course, the spotlight, and I really, really enjoyed those. Um, I guess, starting out here, uh, these mini figures, um, of course, the Stormtroopers go to build my army. I need a Stormtrooper army, so uh, those, of course, do help out. And then a couple of Wookiees go to the Rebel Forces, which will be great. And the Chewbacca, of course, is always welcome. So, Next, we got these pieces. These will come in very handy for Solist. Uh, very excited to have those up here. Got the minifigures for the Minds of Moria set and the Minds of Moria set. I really, really enjoyed this build. Um, it was a fun build to me. Uh, I, I really liked it. And now I am just one minifigure away from completing my fellowship. So very happy to have these minifigures in the build to display. And then the final set is the Resistance Y-Wing. Uh, I really like this set. Uh, it's smoother t than the 26th uh, Team Y-Wing, which I do own. Uh, I like this. I like how they transition to more of the slope pieces and like the wedge plates and stuff. I really like that. And then, of course, the minifigures are phenomenal. I uh, got a little Dio here. got a turquoise blue astromech, which... It's kind of a weird color combination for an astromech wood, but I think it looks nice. Um, then got a snow trooper, which with the cape looks just as good as the older ones do. And Zori Bliss is a really cool minifigure, and Poe Dameron is a new minifigure in his uh, Rise of Skywalker wear, and I, I really do like that. So overall, very good haul, quite sizable, and really enjoyed building the sets and looking forward to building that one. So yeah, uh, if you guys enjoyed this, please... Leave a like, comment, subscribe down below, and as always guys, thank you for watching.